I've had a couple of people tell me that their wives or girlfriends are, are so involved with the kids that they are not even in the top five priorities in the relationship. They feel like they're the bottom of the barrel. And then there's other people that have said that the dogs, the pets, the, the animals have become the priority over the partner. Or somebody's playing a lot of video games or they've got a hobby that takes up all their time and their partner's way, way, way down on the low priority list. Why would you be in a relationship and feel alone? There's nothing worse than being lonely while you're in a relationship. So again, I, I keep bringing this up over and over again because that happens in so many different scenarios that we do forget about our partners. We get so lazy and we become just sort of, you know, living our lives and doing what makes us happy without putting the other person as a, a you know, top on the list. We have to stop doing this. People hate dating today, but they don't make huge efforts to maintain their relationships anymore. Yes, our kids need us. Yes, our pets need us. Our careers need us. Our hobbies, not so much, but we still tend to put all these things out there over our relationships. You were there together as a couple. All these other things probably came after the fact. Or if they were there when you first met each other, you still made a priority to keep that relationship going for those first couple of years. So why are you not doing that now? I'm telling you, with all these letters and things that I'm getting, it's really becoming a big problem. People just think that, oh, well, it's, it's okay, they'll get over it, you know, I'm, this is what I want to do and, and they just have to compromise. But they don't have to compromise. You need to compromise. You need to be able to fit all these things into your life. Ladies, I hear this from men a lot about how women put so much energy, energy into their children and forget about their, their spouse or partner. And this isn't right. You made a baby together, right? Remember how you did that? Remember how you got there? You got to keep that up too. You got to keep the romance alive. You've got to keep, you know, the sexual chemistry going. It's not just about, you know, the kid's soccer game or play dates with other, other moms or please make sure that you nurture your relationship. And same for guys. Don't put all your other hobbies and things ahead of your partner. And I love pets like most people do, but I am finding that a lot of people are making their pet a priority over their, their partner again. The trick here is everybody, you need to compromise. You need to have your full life with lots of things going on, but you need how to put them into a space where that you can have them all. But your relationship should always be number one. Don't let somebody or something come in to replace that. It's really not that hard to do. You just have to be aware of it and you have to listen to your partner. If they're telling you that they're feeling replaced or they're feeling ignored or they don't feel like they're in a relationship, you better listen to them or you're going to be back out single again. Maybe that's what you want. Maybe that's where you're trying to go. But if that's the case, just be honest that you're not happy and that you want to move on from the relationship. Don't let your partner sit there feeling like they're alone within a relationship. Anyway, little bit of a, but it is something that can be really looked into and fixed. And don't leave it too long before it becomes where you've just pushed each other away so far. There is no going back. Take some time for each other. At the very least, listen to each other, listen to what their needs are, and compromise. Thanks everyone for listening to Dear Cyber Sue. Please tune in every Wednesday where I upload on YouTube and my blog at Dear Cyber Sue. I upload blogs and videos every Thursday and sometimes more. Thanks everyone. Please leave your comments below and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.